Good evening, ladies and gents, and all my center pin heads. How's it going? This is Danny Colville from Colville Outfitters and Custom Tackle coming to you for the second time tonight. It's April 10th or April 11th or something like that, and I wanted to show you some cool center pins. So I know you guys love this. I know you've been asking for it. So I'm going to show you what we got going on. Again, Please excuse that annoying beeping noise. I am going to get that fixed this week, I promise. So next video shouldn't have that. All right, let's get started here. So we have our most recent builds right here and down on this box. Um, before I forget, uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. And if you like what you see, give us a thumbs up. And the other thing, if you haven't ordered your Bow Branches, Colville Outfitter, Colville Swag, please uh, order it today. We only have limited numbers. Here's a quick little uh, view of it. This is a Neil Santos artwork. Neil is an incredible outdoor artist from Florida. He does some amazing stuff. We got these 10-ounce heavyweight Hanes hoodies available. We have awesome Gavin Irwin artwork. Here's the Bow Branches T on a Gildan Soft Stretch. We got our Under Armour with the Gavin Irwin artwork on the back. And there's another, some silver foil shirts. Actually, it's silver glitter silk screening. We got some cool hats with the same artwork. So please show your support. And uh, we would really appreciate it if you would purchase one of our hoodies, shirts, or hats. And uh, let's get started here. All right, so first and foremost, as you guys know, we've been working on our Silver Series Trinity. Well, here it is, and boy, is it amazing. So what makes these ones so much better than our old ones? So I keep talking about this hub inside the reel. And as you can see, if you look in there, there's a stainless steel part around the bearing housing. That is separate from the spool. So... We are now loading, preloading the bearings into the housing. It gives us, uh, we can hold better tolerances, um, and it gives us, uh, we have better luck with the bearing differences because we can adjust the hub better. Preload it. If you guys need another one, you send your old one in. We ship you the new one, and we're good to go. You just put it back together, and there it goes. So... What else is new? So if you notice, no more brass parts. We are going to have some stainless parts coming up, but instead of the handle post being brass, the handle posts are now the color of the back plate. So these production reels are becoming more custom. They were never really a production reel, but I like to call them that because we were running like 25 at a time or something. So we have 25 of each of these silver series available. We have 25 Trinity 5.5s and, and 25 Leviathan two um five and a halfs uh we got a nice strong clicker on these guys uh we got a new bearing we're using a abex 7 ceramic um orange shield boca um abex 7 really good bearing the knob is now changed it has this knurling instead of the diamond knurling a little bit more comfortable a little bit more room to grab the washer on the back is stainless instead of brass if your Trinity doesn't have this little white washer underneath it, it should because that stops any sort of oxidization, which we probably won't have with a stainless, but we were having with a brass. You'll also notice we used to have four little screws for the, the click and pawl inside the post to hold the clicker mechanism. We now only have one panhead screw. And now the feet are also aluminum instead of brass. So... Uh, that's a new uh, that's a new Silver Series Trinities. They are amazing. I'm gonna spin one here for you. And they have that chrome whisper that I always talk about. As you guys know, you want to feel your reel and hear your reel spin. You want it to be a nice, smooth, consistent purr, and that means you can feel it. it tells you what. It basically sends a message to your brain on if you need to slow the reel down or not give it so much tension on a cast and during a drift. Okay, next we have for Nathan Batts of Kalamazoo. Here is your beautiful custom dream catcher. We have the new um, handles on there. 
Uh, so I got Nathan three sets of handles. These are the new big water handles. They're for the Pacific Northwest series. I put them on because they look so darn cool. But really, he should be starting off with the normal size handles, which are which are right here. So Nathan, take these big boys off and put on the normal size because I think when you try to cast, they're going to wrap around the handle. They are tapered at the very, very end, but you still might have a little problem with handle wrap. But uh, yeah, check these things out, guys. They are unbelievable. Super cool. Super... Uh, Super big, super long. Guys at BC Cast should have no problem with them, or Wallace Cast, as long as you're pretty good. Sidecasters, I don't know. So I decided to put a little strip of white backing in there, since I knew I was going to run these blue and white handles for you, Nathan. I hope you like it. So we got our orange backing, strip of white backing, blue 15-pound blood run. We got our dream catcher on the back with our Paragon Fish, custom ordered. Thank you, Nathan. I appreciate everything, bud. Cody, good old Cody Godwin. He's got the biggest CPR collection out there. Here is his one-of-a-kind Delta 1000. There are 1,000 holes drilled on the front of this reel. Check that out, guys. Pretty cool. He also is going to get the next size down from that giant size. These are still the Olympic Series handles, so they're a giant handle. I want to see how Cody likes it. We are not releasing it yet, so guys, please don't call and ask for these because they're not available. I am just putting them on a couple reels so people can try it. On another note, I just touched that reel with one little one little flick, and it's still going. So it's like four or five minutes on a little flick with my thumb. Pretty awesome. All right, so uh, yeah, this is a gunmetal and black splash with a gunmetal backplate. Gavin Irwin artwork on the back. Check her out, Code. All right, up next we got a all orange. Dreamcatcher 535 Black Accents. This one is available. If you guys are interested, hit me up. This is for my friend Brandon in... I think his name is Brandon... Uh, I can't remember. But Brandon, anyways, this is his custom reel. He got a super beautiful steelhead blue Dreamcatcher 535 with the Death Row logo on the back. Really super cool reel. Brandon Chez, I hope you're happy, brother. This is going to my friend Ted in Washington. I hope you like this one, Ted. This is our very last dream catcher, guys. I think I have uh, one other one that might be available, but uh, I'm waiting for my friend Dan Barron to get his, which you'll see in a second. And then this one is going to Ted. I can't remember Ted's last name. Excuse me, but this is pretty awesome. This is that new hard coat blue. So this is actually a true type 3 hard coat blue, and there's that Trinity just dying. I don't know if you guys have kept track of how long that's been spinning, but damn, is that a good startup. So this is a Trinity, fi uh, I'm sorry, Dream Seamstress. Sorry, too many reels. Seamstress 535 on blue hard coat, tangerine spool. Last one available, I think, there might be one in this video for Lena Locke. Thank you for your patience, Lena. And I'm sorry I couldn't get your artwork to work. And my buddy Jason, thank you for being patient with me. I tried to get this baby done. The artwork was giving me a little bit of a hard time. Got some custom handles for you. One of the only salmon color. This is the actual only salmon dream catcher out there in a 485. Heart coat gray backplate. Jason is going to be making some really cool real backplate skins. Um, his business is called Fresh Threads. He does awesome decals and clothing and stuff like that. So check him out. Jason, I can't pronounce your last name. It's D-Z-I-K-I-E-W-I-C-Z. -I -I -E Jason's awesome. Great customer. I appreciate all the business, Jason. And Lena, I hope you like your reel. I think it's super cool. I'll send you some extra components to go with it. Sorry for the wait. I do have another beautiful salmon colored drop back. So when I do these reels, I have to do, they usually like me to do 12 of them in a color to fill the lot, but I had to do like three or four. So it wasn't a couple hundred dollars for 
one reel. So I did a couple in this color. So if you like salmon, if your girlfriend uh, or wife, or if you just like this color, I mean, it is a super cool color. Maybe your daughter, maybe your gay son, whatever. I mean, it's super cool either way. So if you do like this, uh, this salmon color, get at me. I do have a drop back. This is a 485 featuring Trevor Hawkins artwork on the back. Beautiful reel. I have this boomer available. This is a gunmetal dream catcher with the shoots blue accents. Use Neil Santos bow branches on the back. I mean, this one shouldn't last long. I mean, look at this baby. And the startup of these, ooh, are they just sick. I'll just give this a nice little flick and we'll see how long she goes for. All right, up next, we got a hard coat gray katana with a red back plate with a katana artwork for my pro staff in Ohio, Tim Miller. Hope you like it, Tim. She's a beaut. I'll get some extra components for you, and you will be trying out the bigger handles to see how they work. For my buddy Joey Lehman, thank you, Joey. He traded in a kingpin and some cash for this beautiful baby here. We got a Dreamcatcher 535, and we got Neil Santos Tribal Salmon. Look at that, guys. Pretty wicked. This is definitely a one-of-a-kind reel. As you know, with the 19 colors and seven designs we have, it's pretty hard to get the exact reel of somebody else. And as you can see, the startup's amazing. I need two hands to get the clicker going, so I won't be able to do that right now. Sorry I don't have a tripod. I mean, I do have a tripod, but I can't hold the camera with it. All right. I hope you guys got that joke. Anyways. So what do we got here? A Leviathan. So we reintroduced the Leviathan. It's on the Trinity platform, the Silver Series. So it's got that detached hub. We got those nice big eight classic holes with the inside teardrops. What a classic reel. Just like the Drifter style. This has Raul Lopez artwork on the back. Raul's from Michigan. He did a, another series of the Leviathan. So I was hoping to get a serpent with a salmon head, kind of dragonish looking, eating a steelhead to symbolize this giant reel demolishing steelhead. We also have... You Neil Santos OG style. We got a ghost white spool here with a red back plate. The Trinities and the Leviathans, they come matte. All the other reels come hand polished gloss. We may sometime in the future offer some gloss Trinities and Leviathans. As of right now, we are not. So if you want a matte colored reel, the matte is really cool. It doesn't show a glare in the water. All right, now here is a flat colored, here's that salmon in a flat color with some purple. Classic Nick LaFerrier Trinity logo on the back. Absolutely stunning. So great clicker, beautiful reel. If you want a nice five and a half inch reel, these are tried and true as of, as, as all of my reels are. So I'm sure you'll like them. We still have a great deal going on all of our dream catchers, if, or not dream catchers, all of our fjords. If you guys are interested in a fjord, we have like four or five left. These are 2018 series fjord three, so we have them on closeout. So if you're interested, get a hold of me. Uh, my contact info will be somewhere in the video, but if it's not and you get bored of looking at reels and you're just like, oh my God, I want that one, call me at 716-627-REAL or that 716-627-7335. If the answering machine directs you to another number, call that number because my phones don't work, just like my alarm system. So this is a Pacific Northwest Pine Trinity gloss backplate matte spool nickel plated finger tab so if you want a really good deal on a five inch reel made in america lifetime warranty here's a good one for you all right what do we got next people this is what i like to see so 
in eight years of owning this shop, I've never been three deep in the case. That's right, three reels deep all the way down. Plus, I have all of these reels in here. We do have a lot of people's reels down there waiting for pickup. Who's do we got? We got Fred Rasmith's. Fred, you got to get your reel. It's a black katana, silver accents. It's the last black katana out there, so you better grab it, buddy, because somebody else is going to. Drew Caden from Canada. Check this out. Blue color fill drop back, blue back plate, black spool, color filled holes. What a banger this one is. Bow branches artwork. This one is going to slay. It's got good steelhead mojo. I could feel it. Floyd Greathouse. My boy Floyd. Soft plastic master. All right, Floyd. Here's your reel, buddy. Whenever you're ready for it, she's a waiting for you. It's with one of the last dropbacks in this color available. This is Pacific Northwest Pine Spool with a Bogashiel bronze backplate. Trevor Hawkins drop back artwork on the back. If you haven't checked out Floyd Great House, check him out. FMG Fishing, some of the best soft plastics out there, period. I can pull this one out because this one is going to Jason D, who is Lena Locks man. This one I've been holding on to forever. It's everybody's try to buy this reel. This is the last Delta 750. Full hard coat gray with a carbon fiber back plate. So we're going to throw some yellow backer on there. Ship it out with Lena's reel. What a banger this one is. So here you go, guys. Here's your babies. You could finally get this reel, Jason, and Lena won't yell at you that you got another one now. And Lena, I will throw you in a whole bunch of components to make sure you can dress that reel up to make it look super pretty. Jason, I hope you like your Delta. I love it. It's super pretty. All right, let's go and see who else reel we have. We got we got a really cool reel here for Josh Collette. Josh got a steelhead blue drop back with a rogue red back plate with a Washington Capitals logo on it. Check that out. Pretty cool. All right, Josh, if you haven't got a hold of me, you're real sitting here waiting to be baptized and christened with some chrome, so get at it. All right, my friend, Brian Speckard. Hey, buddy, what's up? I hope you're watching this. You stopped in, and I didn't put the bow branches on the back of his reel. Why he was here, he wanted to change up the back plate to a blue hard coat, which was fine because I messed up the other one. So he's got a blue hard coat with Usneel Santos bow branches, and he's got a sharp point katana. Oh my god, this one is such a runner. Yeah, baby. All right, Brian Specker, come get your reel, buddy. Hopefully we'll get you out fishing too. All right, I'll walk you through these other one, guys. Then we'll go up to the top cases. All right, so we got a red and black Trinity 535. We got a rogue red back plate with the Trinity, the OG Trinity artwork from Nick. Matte black spool, super classic, super pretty. We got a super cool Leviathan Bogus Shield bronze flat color custom acrylic handles, Pacific Northwest Pine, newer Leviathan artwork on the back plate. Here's an interesting one. We got a purple and tangerine Leviathan with the spin reaper on the back plate. Delta 1000 with color filled holes. I got to touch these up a little bit. I got to go in there with a razor and scrape away some of that paint. But this one is available, all black Delta 1000 with the Paragon Fish, turquoise fi color filled holes. We got a Silver Series Trinity right here, all Pacific Northwest Pine, Trinity 545. So you got a five and a half inch reel here, guys. 
And we got Trevor Hawkins' Legends of the Fall on the back. Look at that reel. Damn. Someone's going to house some chrome with that. One of my favorites. Oh, yeah. This is a Bogus Shield Bronze Spool Trinity with a Deschutes Blue backplate. Look at that nice bright blue. What's so cool about the matte colors is it picks up so many different colors in different shades of light. So you go outside, it'll look way different. Some custom blue handles on there. Somebody's going to be happy with that guy. Concord purple, ghost white backplate. This is a cool one. I had a customer want an Iron Maiden theme center pin. So I did two of them just in case I messed up the first one. So there is one available. Actually, it's not. Sorry. This is Jake Micolette, my boy from Oregon. Slayer of Oregon Coastal Steel. This is a Paragon 535, an Oregon candy apple green with a hard coat black backplate featuring Eddie from Iron Maiden. Let me know when you want that reel, Jake. It's sitting here, not catching chrome. All right, this one's available. It's a black and orange Paragon with a seamstress logo on the back. So if you want something kind of vintage OG with a Paragon spool, but you want the seamstress artwork, here's a great reel for you. It's available today. This is a super classy, super sleek looking reel. This is a Pacific Northwest Pine Dream Catcher. With a bogus shield bronze backplate featuring Usneel Santos bow branches with that mean, nasty looking salmon turning into a tree. It's a circle of life right there, basically, guys. Delta 1000 in tangerine and black. Gavin Irwin artwork available. Bronze, Bogus Shield Bronze Katana, 485, so 4.85 inches, featuring the Katana artwork on the back. I see a banger coming. Here we go. Oh, yeah, this is a tangerine drop back with a black back plate featuring Trevor Hawkins' drop back artwork. This one is also available. All right, let's see what we got in the bargain cave over here. Guys, I know my shop is messy, but it's organized chaos, so some people offer to come over and help me clean. I know where everything is, though. I don't want to clean it up. Okay, so what do we got over here? So we got a Paragon, all black with bronze accents. Check that guy out. Pretty cool. This is a really cool reel. I haven't seen one in this color yet. So this is a gold backplate katana with a bronze spool. Like, man, that is classy. That would look cool on a custom build right there. I want to point something out. I just spun this one. And if you listen closely, you'll hear a tiny little squeak. And I've gotten some people messaging me and calling me, asking me what the squeak is. If you guys know what ceramic is, it's basically like a stone. And when the little balls are rubbing on each other, balls rubbing on each other. <laughs> um, but when the little balls are rolling on each other, they, uh, they create a little bit of a squeaking noise. There is nothing wrong with that. It doesn't slow down your reel. It's doing what it's supposed to. They are self-lubricating bearings. They don't need any oil. They don't need any grease. Don't put any in unless you want to slow your reel down. If you are going to use oil, please use something that's rated for like negative 30 degrees and is really super thin because I've seen more people bring their reels in and they say they don't spin good in the cold and they spin fine when they bring them in the shop. And it's only because their bearings are, are getting all gummed up because of the cold weather and the oil they put in. So here's a really cool reel. This is a Paragon 485 tangerine backplate to shoots blue spool. Another just ripping cool reel. Check that out. OG Paragon. All 
Okay, what do we got here? This is a dropback 360. There is not many of these, so if you like this, hop on it because you're going to be the only one with one of these for sure, especially in this color combo. This is black spool bogus shield bronze backplate featuring Trevor Hawkins' dropback artwork. If you guys haven't checked out Trevor Hawkins, check him out. He is one incredible artist. He's from Australia. And we have some trichromes. There, guys, are the last trichromes in existence, never to be made again. So if you want one of these cool reels, they were made when marijuana was illegal. What a story to tell, because it's all going to be legal everywhere pretty damn soon. So let's check out what we got. We got a trichrome with green leaves on green, black back plate. There's a matching one right next to it. There's a purple one with black backplate, purple spool, purple leaves. One of a kind Spin Reaper trichrome. Green on green, silver leaves. That's a rare one. Here is a hard coat red, the only one of these available. Hard coat red spool. Red back or uh, black back plate, Christopher Allen tribal fish artwork, green on black, and do we have a green on black with silver leaves? Uh, no, we don't. So that's another one right there, the same thing. Um, I do have this cool boulder. Um, this is a boulder five inch purple heart back plate unfinished you could finish it with poly if you want or you can keep it flat your choice killer deal on this reel if you guys are looking for a good entry level reel and you don't want dirt to get in it this is the reel for you to get we have a super beautiful paragon 535 right here with a John Salvalzo tribal fish on the back. Really cool one. You won't see this one again. Real classy. I mean, these things literally take nothing to get going, guys. I mean, what startup do these reels have? Holy cow. I hope everyone who has them is enjoying them. I know they are because they're ordering more. Here is a reel that is available. This is a full hard coat Fjord 3 red velvet with nickel tabs if you're interested hit me up i'll work a killer deal out with you here's a fjord 3 all hard coat gray with salmon color tabs and accents steelhead blue fjord 3 with gold accents fire this is just what a killer reel this is how did this one not sell am i asking too much money for it or something I don't know, guys. Get at me if you need a Fjord. If you like reeling with your fingers, this is the reel for you. Awesome reel. Great startup. Great line pickup. Same diameter as the other reels. Not the same width as a Fjord 2, and it has that sweet bearing cover. All right, that's it for this case. Let's look in the big boy case. All right. So, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Three deep here. We'll start at the top. All right, so I have a Leviathan Deschutes Blue Backplate Ghost White Spool Ledges of the Fall Artwork. So, no one's really seen these reels. You guys have first dibs at them, literally. So, when these, when people see these, they're probably going to go. So, if you're interested, please get at me. Now is the best time to buy. We are getting to the end of the run. We're going to try to have some new stuff by Christmas of next year. Actually, Christmas of this year. I'm sorry. And we're going to try to have some other new reels available coming 2020. We have the Olympic Series coming. 5.85 inches. But we don't really have a set date. We're hoping to have it for the winter run of Steelhead next year. January, February 2020. So, Olympic Series. Alright, back to what we have here. Sorry, ADD kicking in. It's late and I haven't eaten today. Alright, this is a Steelhead Blue Dreamcatcher with a hard coat backplate. 
Kevin Roberts artwork on the back, that Atlantic salmon with a super cool Dreamcatcher headdress. Another stunning reel. I put all the ones that are my favorite on the top that I'm probably going to keep eventually if they don't sell. But this is a silver dream catcher. Not many silver reels out there. So if you like the silver, hop on this. Kevin Roberts artwork on the back. Silver on steelhead blue. Dream catcher 535. I should probably spin some of these, right, guys? You want to see them spinning? Wagon wheel, which way is it spinning? That way. Killer startup, beautiful reel. Get at it, guys. Come on. There is a hard coat, nope, not a hard coat. Steelhead blue, Paragon 535 with a gunmetal backplate. Classy looking. Katana 535, black spool, orange acrylic accents, gone metal backplate. Here's a real sexy one. One of the last one of these. This is a katana with sharp points, all Concord purple. With the monstrosity of a clicker. A lot easier if I have a handle to give me some leverage. So purple with black accents. What a beauty. What a beauty. Katana 535. Big boy reel for big fish. Really pretty delta. Black spool. Bogashil bronze back plate, 4.85 inches. Another Concord purple delta, purple spool, gunmetal back plate, Gavin, Art, Gavin Irwin artwork on the back. Beauty, 4.85 inches. Let's spin one of these just so you guys can see that these babies go. I always love the deltas. Those are always such a cool uh, wagon wheel effect. Just got to get it at the right speed. They start getting like a cool lotus petal design towards the center when they start spinning at the right speed. She wants to start going in the opposite direction. You are getting sleepy. Almost there. All right, there we go. It's starting to go backwards. There's the wagon wheel effect. Look at the inside holes are going to the right, and the handles are spinning to the left. Up. Oh. Now it just switched up. All right, enough of looking at this purple reel. Let's keep going. All right, we got a purple katana. Really cool. It's that deep, dark purple, Concord purple with... Gun metal backplate, super pretty. All right, let's see what we got here. We have a Dream Catcher 4.85 inch, all gun metal with steelhead blue accents. Kevin Roberts artwork on the back. We got a Skittles colored 4.85 Dream Catcher. That's Oregon Candy Apple Green or Oregon Sage with Concord Purple. Really pretty reel. This also has Kevin Roberts artwork on the back. There is also a Gunmetal and Purple one back there. This is sad. I'm getting to the end of the batch of these guys. This is like depressing. I wish I had a bunch more to build and show you guys every week, but... We got our orders done, so this is what's left and what's available. So, all right, we got a Dreamcatcher 535 gunmetal spool, rogue red backplate. And 
And that was a 485, not a 535. I'm sorry. Here's another Dreamcatcher 485. Steelhead blue with Harco gray backplate. Really classic looking reel. I mean, how do you not love this thing? I mean, stellar. Paragon with a gunmetal spool. Bogus Shield bronze backplate. Featuring the Spin Reaper. So a Spin Reaper Edition Paragon here if you guys are interested. 535. Big boy reel. Purple and black Paragon 535 with the regular Paragon artwork on the back. And we got a Pacific Northwest Pine Paragon spool with a rogue red backplate. Really super cool and unique there. This one I think is sold, but if you call me before it goes, it's yours. This is an all black katana and hard coat katana 535 with orange accents. This one's killer. This is like the Seahawks reel. I had to copy this. A couple people got this color and it is just fire. So this is Oregon candy apple green with... Um, a hard coat blue backplate featuring Trevor, or not Trevor Hawkins. This is Usneel Santos. Usneel Santos backplate. One of a kind. This one should go. I would say that one's going to sell probably the fastest out of all of these. There's a gold, uh, gold backplate with a candy apple Oregon, Oregon candy apple spool gold backplate. Pretty real. Hand polish finish is awesome. All right, we have a hard coat blue Paragon with a hard coat black backplate with Usneel Santos bow branches. This is a Paragon 485 hard coat blue. So this is a near murdered out Paragon 485. So it's all black with gunmetal accents. Normal Paragon logo on the back. And there is a murdered out Paragon. All black on black on black. Pretty wicked. And this one has the bow branches on the back. That one should also go fast, I'm predicting. Okay. I'll try to slide my hand over here and do this like this. Here we go. This is the very, very last dream catcher, guys. I can, why am I calling the reels the wrong names? This is the very, very last seamstress, guys. So here is a seamstress tangerine on black. It's got some cool custom acrylic handles on it. Cool thing about these reels too is you can buy accents for them or I can throw them in because we are nice guys at Colville Precision Reels. Tony is super nice and I am nice. We could dress your reel out like that. Give it a cool look. If you do want to buy an extra set of handles and center caps and I'm not throwing it in with your reel, they are $50 for a set of handles and center cap and you're good to go. All right, we have a really cool one-of-a-kind drop back. This is like a drop back 360 squared, Boga Shield bronze and Concord purple with Trevor Hawkins. Drop back artwork on the back. That's a beauty. Let's slide this over. There is another drop back 360 squared. Here is a killer. This one should go steelhead blue. With lemon yellow backplate. Look at that thing, guys. Yowzer. Somebody's going to get a really cool reel. Look at that. Lemon yellow just pops. So nice. So let's see. If I was going to dress up lemon yellow, what would I do? Let's see. Okay. So I would pick this handle to go on that. Look at that handle with that. Oh, yeah. And I would get that center now look at that one of the funnest things about this is dressing these babies up 
there you go. So, for example, if you bought that reel, I would throw that set, that $50 set of components in for you. But if you bought your reel and you wanted to order it, it would be $50 later. So you get a pretty good little bargain when you buy your reel up front. I'll dress it up and make it look pretty for you. If I can, if I have the components to do it. Because I want your reel to look stunning, so you're proud of it and you catch lots of fish. Here is a dream catcher with gunmetal accents. Use Neil Santos bow branches. This is the Deschutes Blue. It's a 535 dream catcher. That one should sell super fast. Here is an orange back plate with a black spool. This has some pretty unique uh, acrylic accents on it. This one is a Spin Reaper edition. Look at that, guys. Really super cool. All right, my favorite color, orange and blue. It's totally, totally opposite on the color spectrum. So this is the Deschutes Blue Katana 535 backplate with a tangerine orange spool. All right, what's next? Oh, my God, a hard coat blue katana. This is one of the only one of these. Look at that. Hard coat blue katana with sharp points with a hard coat black backplate. All hard coat katana 535. That is a stunning reel. I hope these, I know these all go to a good home. All right, here we go. Concord purple. Katana 535 with sharp points. Black backplate with the Spin Reaper. Look at that, baby. That's a mean-looking reel. All right, Packers fans, we got a 5.35-inch Paragon. Lemon yellow backplate, Oregon candy apple, or sage green spool with the OG Paragon logo on the back. We have a purple Paragon 535 with some custom acrylic accents, a regular Paragon logo. We got a purple backplate with a black spool Paragon, OG Paragon logo, Paragon 535. We have a beautiful Katana here. This is a Katana 485 Rogue Red backplate gunmetal spool. Super pretty. You want a nice classy reel for fishing for trout or for smaller creeks for steelhead. That is your reel. Orange Katana 485 with a hard coat black back plate. And this one was for my buddy Tim, but I messed it up. Luckily, his name isn't on it. This is a silver back plate with a red spool. Katana 485. What a pretty reel. I don't think there's any matching reels in this case. Isn't that amazing? We randomly build them and there's like it's like hard to get a matcher. So you should be the only one with that reel. You'll I, I would highly doubt you bumping into somebody with the exact same reel as you as far as colors go. All right. Here is our Leviathan. So one of my favorite one. Look at this thing, guys matte tangerine orange with steelhead blue look at this thing holy cow these clickers are not as strong as the platinum series reels but the silver series reel has plenty plenty of strong enough clicker it's stronger than anything you're going to buy out there that isn't a really high priced reel much stronger than an islander or I don't want to name anybody's reels. I don't want to put anybody's reels down, but it's plenty strong. It's as strong as it needs to be. All right, here is a Leviathan with a Pacific Northwest Pine Spool, Bogus Shield Bronze Backplate, Use Neil Santos OG Leviathan logo. We have a Tangerine, Tangerine Leviathan with a bogus shield bronze backplate featuring the new leviathan artwork this one is another slammer this one's gonna sell right away i already know it 
This is a all Oregon candy apple green Leviathan. New artwork on the back. This one will sell instantly. I don't know who the lucky one is that gets it, but you will enjoy this, I promise. Here is a really pretty reel. This one is a Deschutes Blue. See, this clicker is strong. It all depends on how heavy that spring is bent. Sometimes you get a really strong spring, and, and it's bent in the slightest different angle, and it becomes so much stronger. So this is Concord Purple with Deschutes Blue Leviathan. That's a really cool reel. I got these new abalone rod huggers that will go perfect. And the artist that did the new logo, the new Leviathan logo, his name is Raul Lopez from Michigan. He is getting a reel. His, here it is, Catback Designs. There's his face on the back of that reel. So I'm just waiting on a couple more pieces of art from him, and his Silver Series Leviathan will be on its way. Hopefully Raul will come up with some uh, something really cool for some of the new reels or some of the new clothing. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let's look at some Trinity 545s. All right, this one, how is this one still here? I don't know. Look at this one. This is Steelhead Blue on gunmetal. A shaded katana art on the back. Oh, God. Someone's going to be happy very soon with this baby. We have a pure ghost white Trinity with the Trinity logo on the back. We have a Silver Series Trinity Pacific. No, this is Candy Apple Oregon. Oregon Candy Apple Green with a Bogus Shield Bronze backplate with a Trinity logo. We have a ghost white, ghost white spool red backplate Trinity 545. Now that is classy looking. Someone is going to be happy with any of these reels. Everyone I look at, I'm like, I should keep that. How many reels can a guy have though, right? All right, here's another really cool one. Concord purple with the shoots blue. Super pretty. Legends of the Fall artwork. And we got a pretty unique one back there. This one is a salmon pink with bogus shield bronze. Nick L artwork on the back. Okay, and then we got a drop back black spool red back plate it's a 5.35 incher with the bow branches on the back and then we got a stunning stunning purple drop back with a hard coat black back plate with the drop back logo on it i gotta give this one a spin because it's just that pretty if you notice i'm wearing the bow branches shirt right here all right so check it out look at this thing go And if you hear that, that's called the Chrome Whisper. It calls in the steelhead and salmon. But look at this beautiful reel. If you guys are debating about trying one of these, give me a call and get one. There is a Dropback 360 red back plate with a black spool back there hiding out. All right, we're almost to the end, guys. This is like an hour-long video of reels. Holy cow. I told you I had a lot. Choices, choices. I hope you guys hop on this deal, though, and get one. All right, we have an all hard coat red velvet Paragon 485 with a hard coat black back plate. Then we have a bronze Paragon 485 with a black hard coat back plate. There is a murdered out Paragon back there because these seem to be popular, but this one might be for my buddy Jeff. Let's see. Yeah, this is a this is an all black hard coat. Some cool custom crushed muddy ice handles. 
no etching on the back. When you order these guys, you could get anything you want on it on the back plate. You could get no etching, you could get some etching, you can give us something custom. There's an upcharge, we can do it. Um, we're happy to try. It usually needs to be black and white with no shading. We can try to create something, do our best. It's better if you have an artist do it, but we always try to we always try to uh, accommodate all of our customers. Okay, so we have a lemon yellow and purple katana 535. It's a beauty. We have an all red katana 535 with black accents. Look at that baby. We have a Bogashiel Bronze with Pacific Northwest Pine Katana 535. We have a Delta 1000, Delta 1000 Bogashiel Bronze Spool with a hard coat gray backplate with the bow branches on the back. This one I think was supposed to be for somebody and they changed their order. So it's available to you. All right, we have a green Delta 1000 backplate, Oregon candy apple green. So it's got the green on the front, black spool. And we got Gavin Irwin's Delta logo on the back. We got a really cool lemon yellow, lemon yellow Delta with a purple spool. It's a pretty reel right there. I'm a sucker for purple and blue and bronze and green and red and every other color in here. All right. Rogue Red drop back 485 with a hard coat gray back plate. Trevor Hawkins drop back artwork. This reel was supposed to be for somebody, but they changed it. So hop on it, guys. This one is stunning. This is an all bronze drop back. 485 available for you this one is going to go super fast i already know it check this one out guys drop back 485 hard coat gray back plate killer killer super pretty real slay some trout this summer with this i hope there's some guys in colorado and idaho and all those places with those giant trout start getting into this because it is so fun all right here's a beauty this is a dream catcher 535 with some super cool custom acrylic accents on the front with a drop back artwork on the back check it out it even says dream catcher on it a lot of them don't do that if it's something else artwork on it we typically don't take the time to change my fingers stuck in this thing right now okay here we go so as you can see, it says Dreamcatcher 535. It's got the drop back artwork. Pretty wicked cool reel. One of a kind for sure. All right, down to the last two, and then I'm going home and going to sleep. All right, this one, oh my God, holy cow. All right, so we got a hard coat black back plate with Neil Santos Tribal Salmon with Bogashiel Bronze Spool. Mega sweet, strong clicker. Great startup. Dreamcatcher 535. And look at this baby hiding back here. Ooh. Hello, girl. Concord Purple Dreamcatcher 535. With a silver backplate featuring the bow branches. All right, guys. Well, that about wraps it up. Um... There's not much else I wanted to show you. If you check out my earlier YouTube posting, I did a whole bag I set up for my friend Nathan in Kalamazoo. I set him up a Sims Freestone pack, the 2019 model, as if I was setting it up for myself. It was pretty darn cool. I just got to get some of these spooled and shipped out. I am exhausted, though. I don't even know what time it is. It's got to be... 11 12 i forgot to show you guys something oh my god i want to show this to you guys check this out this is the new bait board this is a colville bait board right here so this is for tying egg sacks or scraping skeins or whatever you want to do but this is kind of what you use 
for uh, getting all your row ready for the next day. And you do it on something nice. It's just like owning, like, sure, you could use a piece of cardboard or a piece of wood or something, but why not do it on something nice and something you're proud of? And there is holes for your spoon, your scissors, um, anything else you're going to use. There's a little slot that catches some eggs, or you could leave your spoon in there. And it also comes with a magnetic little peg that holds your spider thread or miracle thread or whatever you're going to use. These are all made locally by a guy. His name is um, Mike, and uh, he does an awesome job on these. They're all individually numbered. This one's number 2 of 12. Check that out. Production run number 1. So, guys, get a bait board. They're $100 for, like, the coolest board ever. I mean, you could use it for a tying board for tying your jigs and stuff. So there's only 12 of these. Get yourself one of them if you want. I know some of you guys appreciate me. I could sign the back for you or whatever if you want to. Um, but, uh, yeah, check that out. I designed that all myself, guys. So this is a... Uh, a product that I designed that I like. I tie all my eggs on it. I scrape my skeins on it. The uh, It's really nice because the um, when you're scraping the skeins, because of the texture, the eggs pop off really super nice. Some of them get trapped in the holes, but uh, you just slide them right off the board and um, you're good to go. But uh, it's got black walnut and maple and alder. And man, what a beautiful, I mean, this is all different inlays of wood here i mean check that out all right and before before i send you guys off i gotta show you the reels that are going out to my friends hold on one second all right my buddy joey princeton if you guys are looking for some of the uh, best fishing in the Pacific Northwest, check out Joe Princeton in the Olympic Peninsula. This reel is for Joe Princeton. This is an OG Leviathan design here. He's always wanted a Leviathan. We went fishing this uh, this spring, and he, uh, he couldn't stop talking about one. So he's got the only Kalama Aqua slash Turquoise Leviathan ever made. Here it is. Leviathan Silver Series, Joey. Hope you're going to like it, bud. She's ready to get shipped out. I got some extra handles and stuff for you. Here is a all-black Leviathan for Nick Wilton. I don't know what happened to Nick. Nick was, Nick was supposed to get this reel and send me some money and i haven't gotten it so i don't know nick i hope i get it. it took me forever to make it thanks for being patient the i mean these guys waited for these reels for like six or eight months and i am so sorry i apologize for the delay but as you can see we have been busy at colville precision reels I also have this shop. All right, this is for Jay Powers. Jay's been showing off another reel he just got from another producer. It looked really nice. He ordered this one from me. So I hope he can fish them next to each other, see which one he likes the most. This is a dropback 485, purple on silver with the spin reaper on the back. Wicked cool. One of a kind. I got some extra custom purple stuff in there for you, Jay, if you need it. All right, this is my buddy Dan Barron. Awaiting Dan. Awaiting for Dan to tell me when to send this baby. This is the seamstress black harco backplate with the Concord purple spool. It's all ready to go. They're boxed up, guys. And this is for Matty Gantris, Captain Matt Gantris. You guys see me on the videos on the Niagara River. He got a hard coat gray katana 535 silver accents i got all kinds of other accents for him too hard coat blue back plate with bow branches on it matt your reel's ready take me fishing please i want to catch some chrome all right well i guess that will do it guys um i don't really have anything else to show you we're almost at an hour 59 minutes and 20 seconds wow this thing's gonna take me like an hour to upload this video but 
it's something fun for you to do when you're not fishing. Watching Danny play with reels with one hand. Let me show you something really fast. We got custom floats from Superior Floats. If you haven't checked out Wes Bender at Superior Floats, check him out. He makes the most fire floats ever. Brian Lee Smith, custom floats, awesome. Superior Floats, awesome. Nick Godwin Floats, awesome. All right, guys, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I look forward to sending you a reel and uh, welcoming you to the CPR family. All right, tight lines and many shiny fish to your feet. Good night.